So I'm going to be showing you an example of how you are going to generate the prompts with ease. So today we are going to be talking about some how to generate your prompt briefly on uh, ChatGPT. I'm going to be using ChatGPT as the main case study. Here. We are not going to be using any other AI apart from ChatGPT because ChatGPT is very easy for each and every one of us to access anytime, anywhere we are. So I'm going to be using that as an example. So follow me as I show you how to generate your prompt easily because most of us don't know how to generate prompts. We are looking for a way to get a good prompt for our designs and I realize that almost everybody that have been coming to my DM to ask for prompts, they mainly come for a flyer design. So I'm going to be showing you an example of how you are going to generate the prompt with ease. So firstly, just head over to your system or to your Android phone. You can go to your Android phone and download Pinterest app. I'm not going to be showing you the phone version. I'm going to be showing you the system version. So head over to your system. Head over to your system and let's go to Pinterest.com interest.com and over here we are going to be seeing different designs that we can actually pick from that we can actually pick from so all what you have to just do is just register your account this is like first time use on this so you can just go to explore as well you can go to explore to see different things and come to search button and search for birthday design or flyer make sure you add design or flyer to it so as you can see it's showing baby design flyer so i'm going to be clicking baby design flyer and let's see what we are going to be having over there it's going to look for us to see so here is the outputs of our search it's going to show you different images different design that has been done by different people and i want to very to make sure of something that you don't pick what is more complicated for you Pick a very simple design. Don't say because you have a very good design here, they are not going to pick a very complicated one. No, go for a very simple one because you are not a designer. You don't know how to go about it. You are just starting up. So I will not want to bug you with so much of it. So just go for a very simple one. And I've done a very simple design on my system that we are going to make use of. So just head over to your chargeability. Upload your image. I've uploaded my own because of the network that we're having here. So I've uploaded my own. This is the image. So I downloaded this image on Pinterest and it's been uploaded on ChatGPT. How do you upload it? Click on this plus button and upload it. You can see that I've been able to use my own free version and I'm going to be able to try again by 3.42 p.m. tomorrow before I can upload another image to my ChatGPT. You can only upload one file at a time in a day if you are using free version. My subscription just elapsed. You only have the chance to upload just once in a day if you are using the free version. So I've exhausted that already. So now I'll write this prompt, which is serve as a prompt engineer and give a prompt to generate this exact design on ChatGPT and also help me with the right word to use. This is just going to be the prompt that I'm going to add to your image. The downloaded image that you downloaded from Pinterest. Take note, the one you downloaded from Pinterest first. So you are going to use that. So after you use that and send these prompts to it, that's the only prompt that you'll be needing. I will not be writing inside the comment section. That's why I'm taking my time to show it now so that you can see it very well. So this is the prompt. So now it will generate this one for you, which is prompt for image generation. As you can see, it's giving me the prompt for DAL and for ChatGPT at CO. But as I said earlier, we're going to be making use of ChatGPT as a case, as a case study. So now we have the prompt and since ChatGPT gave us the prompt using this image. It gave us the prompt that we can use to generate this type of birthday design. So, and with me, I'm going to try something else. I'm thinking we should just try something good and nice for it. So I just changed some other things. I said, inside my prompt, I just input another prompt, which is copy this one. Just come here, copy the prompts. Just copy your prompts and come here and paste the prompts. As you are pasting the prompts, take note, you can just change it to In everything you are doing with ChatGPT, I always advise people to be polite. So I will start with good afternoon. Can you help me generate a design? Can you help me to design? Okay, let's say to design a vibrant birthday flyer for a young boy named so you can put any name that you want i'm going to make use of any name you can just put any name of yours 
and add it to it. Then use a bold orange and yellow gradient background. You can change this bold and yellow gradient color to another thing. You can say black and white because black and white work earlier. You can make use of gold and gold and white at the same time. Can you make use of gold and white? Yes, you can make use of any color that you want. You can make use of just a simple color that you want. Then center the boys photo. You don't need to put that. You just have to upload the image. You, just, you will now say, I will be uploading the image. I uh, will be uploading the boy image. Place large white bold text at the top that says this. Thing. So after that has been done, what you just do is to send your prompt. And I will send my own with the image. I added my image already. And so this is my image here. How do you add your image? You click on plus again to add the image or you drag and drop to your ChatGPT to add the image. And then this is now, this is now my new prompts that I'm making use of. So, and then you create your image by pressing enter. And then we have our image over here. I think it's taking time for us to be real. So you can actually go to library. At the time, it's going to tell you that too much of people are Send a prompt to ChatGPT present feed that they cannot generate your image now. What you have to do is just to hold on. Either you will be notified on your phone through the notification bay or you go to your library on your system. Over here, I'm going to be going to the library. So if you go to head over to the library, if the network is good, it's going to show. Head over to the library or click on this. Okay. It's not on the library. So just click on this. Image is out. So, okay, the image is out here already. So you can actually check it out. You can see the image that I inputted and you can see what is generated out for me. It's actually collected my image, which I don't really like. So as a designer, most times I just use, use this as an example to know how my design is going to be. How I want to do my design. So I can actually click on this to preview. So as you can see, I've been able to preview this. So now we can actually click on the download button, which is at the top here. So you click on download and it will be downloaded to your phone, to your desktop directly. So and that's all you can see how clean it is. So, but if you're a designer and you make sort of a software like a color or Photoshop or anything, you can actually remove this image and then put another image of yours on it if it has collected the image for you. You just have to upload another image and edit it out. So that's all. You can clean the face and add another new face from your color draw or from your Photoshop without any hassle, without any problem. So, I so as you can see, the image has been generated and it's given us a very good vibe for it also. So I will be waiting for your comments in the comment section if you really want me to generate another image for you and how you are going to be going about it. And also I think with this I should be able to I've been able to show you how you are going to be downloading your image from ChatGPT and you are going to be printing it with it. So do where to follow for more tips like this. Do where to follow for more and subscribe to this channel as more of this will be coming to your way soon. Thank you.